I want to tell you about Princess Pinecone. She's a little girl who lives in a great warrior kingdom, but she's the smallest one there. Still, even the smallest warriors dream of great battles and being champions. And like everybody else, warriors have birthdays. Princess Pinecone wants a horse, and not just any horse, a real warrior's horse. And she made sure to let everybody know exactly what she wanted. But when her birthday actually came, she got this. It's a little small. It's a little round. It's not really a warrior horse at all, is it? It's a pony. But you can't say no to a birthday present. So Princess Pinecone took the pony to her room and decided to train it for the upcoming battle. And what a battle it is! There are dodgeballs and spitballs and hairballs and square balls. Those are new. And here comes Princess Pinecone now! Oh no! Here comes Otto the Awful! What could possibly happen when the biggest, meanest warrior in the kingdom faces off against the smallest warrior on the littlest, roundest pony? Well, I think you're going to be very surprised. My name is Kate Beaton, and I think you're going to like this book because I believe that sometimes the smallest warrior is the mightiest, and the champions come in all shapes and sizes. You can find The Princess and the Pony at your Scholastic Book Fair.